Oh shit. Alright, and we are back, people. <clears throat> what is going on? This is Zerby J Sarfax, and today we are playing Jet Set Radio. I know I haven't uploaded because I've been busy, but uh, yeah, you know, we're back in this shit, so let's let's get to it. And as a matter of fact, before anything, before I start doing. Before I start anything, this is way too loud. Literally, on my last video, like, I couldn't hear Jack. Oh, like, I couldn't hear my voice. Literally, that's how bad it was. Like, fuck, dude. And so, yeah, um, fucking, let's do this, man. Because I have not played this. And so, yeah, we're in Kogane, Cir Kogane Circus and Graffiti High. So, um, let's go to Graffiti High. And, um, first guy we're gonna use is... Actually, that's pretty cool. There's spray cans right there. What the hell? Um... Who should we use? We'll use her. We'll use gum. Start off the video. Yeah, it's on. But, so, yeah, basically, um, if you guys are wondering where I've been, well... I've just been at home, but I haven't been... I haven't been able to make videos. And especially, I haven't been able to, like continue this series as um basically fucking like because i've been busy with school and then you know like um it was just thanksgiving so like um happy late ass thanksgiving guys you know i'm i'm a terrible person jesus christ <laughs> but anyway um enough of that bullshit of me going on literally um, but yeah, I've been, I've been fucking busy lately with like catching up with like schoolwork and all that shit, etc. Schoolwork and take, I've been taking care of pups still. Haven't sold any, sadly. So it kind of fucking sucks because, you know, it takes a lot more time. And it takes a lot more time for me to make a video and push it out for you guys. And, uh, basically, you know, tho those little shits have been keeping me busy. And, uh, ba yeah, basically, um, just, like, not being able to, like, fucking make videos kind of sucks. And, yeah. Other than that, uh, you know, just, like, besides, like, taking care of puppies and shit like that I'm not gonna lie I kind of been going to my friend's house like from time to time so like that's another reason that I have not been uploading at all so like that's pretty much another reason why you know what I can't just blame it all on the dogs fuck I'm trying to get that fucking graffiti so these goddamn pigs won't let me do shit but anyway, oh, let me get him, let me get him, let me get him, let, him, let me get him. Yes, sir. Alright. God damn it, gum. Another news, um, fucking... Fucking... Ah... Uh, well, I mean, I don't think there is any other news other than just, uh, Battlefield 2042 came out already. I've been wanting to play that shit. Um, it's gonna take a while for my friend to get me a PC, but slowly but surely, I'll be able to get it. He's getting me a Ryzen 7, which is going to be very awesome, as a matter of fact. Fuck, man. Very hard to make it in there. There we go. Oh, that was my favorite sound. This is my f favorite song off the soundtrack. Literally, it's like, it's one of, it's my favorite to like. I had it to my fucking, as my fucking uh, alarm. Like. This is like a child. Basically, 
This is like so classic. It's a childhood classic, man. Oh damn, I need to get that other one. Before I could even move on with the level. But yeah, basically fucking... In my last video, I'm kind of disappointed in myself because uh, I really fucked up. You could even... You could barely even hear my ass in the fucking video. There we go. Um, do we still got more? Uh, let me check the mission map. Oh yeah, that's right, huh? Yes, sir. All right, so we cleared with this spot right here. So he about to send out the tanks. It's pretty. It's pretty obvious. I mean, fucking. This guy is crazy, man. He's crazy. He'll do anything just to fucking get these dudes that we're playing as, basically. And we're in the... We're in Benton. We're in, like, one of the main parts. It's like a shopping district, you could say. Oh, they're about to fucking call... It. Oh, there we go. That's... That, those are the fucking tanks and shit like that. The street kind of confuses me since there's, like, a light right there. No, I don't want to go... I don't want to do that. Um, yeah, um, you could get really get fucked up with those fucking... With the shit that they fire at you. Fuck! And so yeah, basically, um... No! <laughs> yeah, this shit's like nerve-wracking because fucking... They, they, they... These tanks right here, man, they, they, they no joke. Fuck! Well, this tank right here, yeah, it's no fucking joke because literally he's destroying everything. He's destroying. Oh shit! Fuck! You see what I mean? He fucking me up, man. And, and Jet Set Radio Future, you actually get to take out the person on top. Like first, you get to take out the tank, but and then the fucking person. This one, like this, well, says this is the original Jet Set Radio. They didn't really add that feature. But I mean, you still can't. You could still take down the head. Oh my god. Get that. Yes, sir. We got it. We got it. Stop firing at me. Fuck. Ah, bitch. Yeah, another thing. Try not to fucking die when these assholes are coming after you. Shit. Grab the health can. Grab the fucking health can. Get away from them. Like... Literally, the, those guys are like the bane of my fucking existence right now. Like I fuck, I fucking hate, I hate, I hate them. Oh, we ain't got no spray cans. Fuck. Oh wait, we do now. No. Come on, dude, don't do that. Don't do that. You're gonna fuck with me and my emotions. You're basically gonna just like fuck with me mainly, but like, fuck. All right, come on. Spray that shit! Spray that shit! Spray that shit! This is, uh, Tokyo Underground, I believe? Th that's the name of the- uh, FUCK! That's the name of this graffiti? Tokyo- yeah, Tokyo Underground. Fucking, that's the name of that one. And we got a jet ranking and five- uh, yeah, that is right. Fucking, and five graffiti souls all- yeah, let's return to the garage. Gorilla Music Broadcaster, Jet Set Radio! Let's go to the mailbag. A letter from Mr. Osaki asks, How do I get rid of these nasty roaches? Easy, just burn your house down! Benton Cho is <laughs> a with the Gigi's graffiti. It's even brighter than the neon lights. After their territory was attacked, them noise tanks ran amok. Their circuits must be fried or something. Maybe they'll be eating dinner for breakfast. <laughs> yes, sir. Little doggy back. Pots! God damn it, Let's go save his bitch ass. Fucking pots, bro. Alright. He's suitable for the job. And also him. We're gonna use him for Kogane since he came from there. And then we're gonna use... We're gonna use Tab, aka Corn, for uh, Benton. So, yeah. Poison Jam is hightailing it. They act tough, but they're wussies. 
And as a matter of fact, the song that's playing right now, right now, God, I hope YouTube doesn't freaking copyright strike my ass. <laughs> Uh, they're uh, an underground to uh, Tokyo underground rock band called, literally called Guitar Vader. So like, if YouTube fucks decides to fuck me over, just let let it be known that they're fucking me over for over for uh, the song called Super Brothers. That's the name of the track. Uh, so yeah. Um, other than that, it's I actually like the song. It's pretty cool. Literally, just like, even though it's like a reference to fucking Mario Brothers big time. Alright, come on. We're like making a full circle because, well, yeah, fuck it, why not? Circles, huh? What's your name? Super Brothers. Alright, anyway, stop fucking around. Let's go. Get yo fucking bitch ass over there, Graham. As a matter of fact, get this. I want that. I'd rather have that and drown. Fuck. Those graffiti souls are very fucking important. So, like, if you literally see me make a play like that, just let it be known. These are that important for, like, extra graffiti. Better take this bitch out. Go, go, go! Go! Oh my god, Grim. God damn! Alright, just let there be known that there's one right there still chilling at 10 hits. Yo, bitch ass over there, fucker. Oh yeah, I forgot it. I forgot that was a graffiti soul right there. I was so focused on kill kicking their ass right now. Yes, sir. We're that fucking good at this game. Overall, I really love this game because literally, fucking, it's just so good. The fucking cell shading and the cartoon style, even. Like, no matter how how weird it looks for you guys or anybody, it's like, back then, it was very hard just to program cell shading graphics just like that. And it was very, I believe it was very expensive, if I'm not mistaken, to program it on a freaking Sega Dreamcast, literally, back in like 1999 to 2000, literally. That's how bad, that's how b hard it was and... That's how bad it was with money. Like, look at that. The speakers don't even look 3D, but still. It's <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, you know, it, it fucking like those speakers and shit like that. Hold on, let me show you. Like, I think right here. Like, yeah, you see, like that, like, like that. It basically fucking. You know, it was very hard to program that shit, but they actually managed to pull through, especially for a game like this. Like, it, it's very fucking awesome. I love, I love it. I love it. Literally, like, it inspires me to try fucking aggressive inline skating myself. Which has been something I've attempted when I was a little kid. But then after a while, you know, just, like, got got out of it because, uh, I basically sucked ass. I'm not even gonna lie. But, at the same time, I was really into video games at the time. So, like, big time when I was a little kid, playing Sega Superstars Tennis, just, like, Seeing all a bunch of these characters like looking crazy and sh like basically like this like this is how they looked like they didn't put their Jet Set Radio Future looks um, in the game even though they did put some concept art from the freaking game itself inside that inside that game 
for basically the loading screen. Um, I gotta say, it was such a fucking awesome experience. Like, the way how beat when I saw beat for the first time, I was like, dude, he's fucking awesome. I want to do that. I want to be that. You know, he he was always my fucking favorite character. And then I I had saw Tab too, like fucking same thing, like just like this, like fucking wearing his beanie. Fuck! He launched me back. Anyways, just like this, just wearing his beanie with his freaking neon green skates, just like fucking. All of them just looking awesome, dude. And it was like so fucking awesome when I saw them. And then, you know, we had combo coming around. You basically got to smack him with the fucking tennis ball, knocking him out when um, he would come around on the tennis tennis rail. On the basically what you could call the net because it was basically a rail for practice. But then it was like one of, I don't know how to say it, but like one of those construction shits. I don't know. It's like one of those con like it had construction cones and everything at the time and do keep in mind that this game does Is like under a lot of construction as we speak like you I don't know if you guys saw that crane though like fuck this asshole Like yeah, basically this this game. I don't know what it was but it's like everywhere you go basically construction everywhere and that goes for the fucking that literally goes for the fucking just a radio future game itself too like like um it basically fucking has like an area with like that literally quoted ghetto called uh the res fortified residential zone and like that place is too crazy looking like it is crazy looking i was like what the fuck and like this guy right here he's basically the fucking leader in the next game and obviously like you know gum is right there too and like she basically the one giving you the tutorials and shit like just like in this one and yeah basically fucking it this game is just crazy music that's violently smooth it's jet set radio even if you're locked up in the joint don't forget to turn on that radio the noise tanks just got scrapped. They played too many video games, and now it's game over. No continues either. <laughs> the GG's dog got home safe and sound, but it looks like the noise tanks made some new modifications. Now it moves like a cow. I want to take a milk it too. Why would you wonder that, DJ? What the hell? It's perfectly with the piece for poison jet. Do the love shoppers have the other piece? Guess you gotta ask them. Yeah, their faces just look like the faces of rejection. God damn. Anyway, so that's basically just like how I feel about this game. Oh shit! Here comes Yo Yo. <laughs> he doesn't really sound like that. I'm gonna be honest with you. He does not sound like that. You'll see in a second. His voice sounds deep, but um, right now you'll you'll see. All right, I'm gonna use my main man beat. Cause like that's been my favorite character for a long time. <laughs> Sup and then we just basically like a lot of people freaking a lot of people like them to be like them freaking uh friends that are just like douchey towards each other, like beats like a douchebag apparently. And like and like the freaking and like the fan base, he's no, he, I guess he's labeled as a douchebag. I don't know how though, uh, but like, d to be fair, he is a delinquent. So, like, basically, um, fuck me! Yo! Oh! What? Go! Get away from that motherfucker! Go! Go, B! Go! Run, dude! Skate! Whatever you can do! Fuck me! Alright, go, go, go! 
Fuck, man. All right, cool. We making progress. Yes, sir. Anyway, so yeah. Um, <laughs> as I was telling you guys, fucking yeah, he does not sound like how he just uh, how he sounded like when he freaking comes around in the garage. Um, his voice has always been like like high pitched like that, especially in um, how can I say it? in Jet Set Radio Future? He freaking sounds a little bit higher pitched actually. And uh, he's a lot more slimmer and less chubbier, and he got a lot taller than this version of him. And so yeah, we basically just whooped his ass. <laughs> yes, sir. Yo, I'll join you. Yeah, you better join me, bitch. Counterfeit like you, motherfucker. Yeah, he. he here's one fact about him. When I say that, he's actually, he actually likes counterfeit brands. Like, it's actually a freaking fact. Um, it says on the Wikipedia, actually, for him. I don't know if that's true or not, but I, I guess, even though his traits is a liar. And it is true because it's proven in the second, in the sequel, Jets of Radio Future. Because he tries to lie when he gets kidnapped by the girl, Golden Rhinos. That, yo... I try to fight him off and every no, but in reality he got he got kidnapped, which is pretty funny. You know he he tries to sound like quote unquote the man. For those of y'all who don't know, there's a freaking graffiti soul right there where I stopped. All right, anyway, let's get these fucking cans right here. All right, hold on, is is the graffiti soul right there still? Oh, yes, it is. Get the fucking graffiti soul mother- Yeah, there, there we go. What you doing right there, you fucking punk rocker? Fuck. You know what's going on? And like, I feel like shit- This fucking game inspired shit like uh, the anime Air Gear because like That anime is pretty fucking dope and like, sadly Like, the manga's still- I- The manga's still a thing but the anime itself, like, it never got a second season. Like, after the main character, his name is Iki. Um, he tries to do this uh, deadly ass jump, which could end one of his friend's lives. And uh, so, basically, um, I remember just like the whole fucking aesthetic of it. Like give it gives off this video game's vibe right here, which I really like because it also has a cool soundtrack. Oh yeah, I forgot about this jump. Yeah, there's also gonna be graffiti souls up here. Yes sir. Take all the speed we can get. Take all the speed we can get. Yes sir. And just like that, we will we will poison gem. I mean fucking the love shocker's ass. So yeah. Martians come all the way to Earth just to listen to us. We're Tokyo's finest pirate radio, Jet Set Radio. One of the yep. four love shockers was holding a golden rhinoceros badge. The golden rhinos are a gang of ruthless Asian killers. Rumor has it, they're the ones who kidnapped boys in jam too. The Rokoku group is run by a strange fella named Goji Rokoku. It's a huge business conglomerate that pretty much owns the city. Rokoku Project 2000 is Goji's big city improvement plan to increase productivity and prosperity in the area. The future of Tokyo, he said. If you ask me, it's just a bunch of bull. Them guys have been erasing a lot of GG graffiti. Are the GGs gonna sit back and take it? The Golden Rhinos and the Rokuku project got nothing to do with me. It is dangerous to get involved. But you gotta give back what you take, right? <laughs> it's funny because he gets kidnapped in the second game. If I if I can download an emulator soon. I would gladly play Jet Set Radio Future for you guys, cause that game is fucking awesome. Yo, kid, you think we could join? You think you can join? You got what it takes? I'm pretty sure, yeah. 
you know, <laughs> this is actually a pretty cool part of this game because it's a different chapter. Because originally, though, these characters, um, they don't have. There's no second chapter in it in the game for like Japan. But this is like the American version, so like, um, her clothing was changed. To oh fuck! Oh, I guess I guess we'll work with it. Um, she has a gray shirt instead, which is on the concept art too. I was about to fuck that up. Uh, she has a gray shirt with her concept art instead of like um that short shirt that she got. I think like a tank top, some shit like that she got on. But uh, yeah, and combo right now, this guy. Uh, y y yeah, he, this, this wasn't a part of the original shit, but, uh, I guess, um, I forgot what it was. I saw, I saw, I watched a video on this. I watched a video on what it was all about, um, what they have, um, what they were originally gonna freaking put, but didn't make the game, like, um, Originally, one of this guy's tags that I'm using right now, the one with the big ass cereals, his name's Combo. Um, originally, one of his tags was going to be Yo-Yo tags. Basically, the guy with the green, the green hoodie that we, we basically, ah, oh, fuck. Basically, the guy with the green hoodie that we had just beaten in that uh, race, which it's funny because we're doing another race right now too. Let's go. Alright. That's my that's my way of like uh, beating beats ass. Because like it's annoying. And the worst part is when when we come up right here because like doing vert tricks is like annoying for me, dude. Like I'm surprised I didn't fuck that up because usually like 50-50 Oh shit, come on, get up, dude. Don't fuck up like that, my guy. Out of like... Fucking... It's a 50-50 chance that I get it... Or I don't, because I still fuck up with that. And I've been like... And I've been like playing this game for a long time, basically. But I, I you know, I won right there. We basically whooped his ass. Yeah, that's where I'll bring it on. But, um... Fucking... Yeah, like... Fucking the ex the aesthetic of this game is just awesome. It's just like brings I don't know just it just brings some type of vibe that's like unexplainable but like you know it's like you could explain it to yourself. Grind City, my turf. My name's Combo, and me, Cube, and Coin used to own the Banton Street area in this city. It's a little far from Tokyo, but everyone used to stay out of our way there. Till recently, that is. Someone been going around painting these ugly signs all over Grand City. It's so ugly I can't even call it graffiti. Strange paintings of rhinos and bizarre symbols. All of our old graffiti's been covered up by these horrific signs. And on top of that, coin has been kidnapped and his enormous collection of records has been destroyed. Ever since the emergence of these paintings, strange things have been happening in this city too. Unfamiliar black cars and men in black suits are hanging around the streets as if they're waiting for something. Wait, was that statue here at Grind Square always this color? There's definitely something wrong here. I smell something fishy going on. Anyway, so yeah, um, this game is just awesome. Anyway, so right now, this this chapter is basically about how um their friend has gotten missing, and so um basically they're going to find out what's going on and see what happens sick puppy haze slide no i think i'll just go with the the prey and spray yeah no this is badass um fucking yeah <clears throat> and this is a required chapter that you gotta do because literally 
you can't do anything else. This is badass. It's Rob Zombie Dragula. You didn't find shit, my guy. Yeah, this this place like has a bunch of fucking graffiti souls, so like if any of you guys decide to like fucking get this game, you know, I highly recommend that you get it because like literally it's awesome. I, I love I love this game dude. Come on, get that shit man. Okay, I understand that she's a hoe, but you ain't gotta say it out loud, my guy. <laughs> it sounds like they're just saying ho, 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 ho. Even though that basically is what the fuck they're saying, but like... You you decide to stop right there and not fucking wall slide. Ah, oh, you missed it. I was about to get shot. Oh, they're coming. Get the fuck away. Fuck, dude. Dude, you I hate the I hate the cutscenes because literally fucking Um the cutscenes literally just like fuck you over sometimes when like you're just like performing. Fuck like that, literally like that. You just like Sometimes, that was my fault, but fuck. Oh, yeah, they'd be pro- Some of these freaking- Oh, hi, hi, how are you all doing? Yeah, you think this, you think this is okay to do this, man? Dude, no, no. Yes, sir. I think if I'm not mistaken. Oh my God, there's more golden rhinoceros people. Oh, I don't think I made that jump. Oh well. <laughs> you can actually grind on that little basketball court, actually. I'm pretty sure I could do it. Hold on. Fuck! Cool. 
Yes, sir. Yeah, they got a lot of freaking... They got a lot of freaking regular soundtracks from, like, real artists and shit like that. So, basically... It's like... I'm basically begging for, like, a copyright, even though... I'm, I'm pretty sure that I'm not gonna get fucked over that easily since, uh... You know... YouTube doesn't care for the small, uh... For the small channels that much, anyway. And even though some... I get pissed sometimes whenever, like, they send me notifications of, like, oh, your video cannot be played in other countries and shit like that. Like, that shit actually pisses me off because it's like, dude, are you serious? It's like, fucking, I hate that shit. Because then that, oh my god, you really sent me flying down, you fucking blonde, white, fucking privileged piece of shit. Come on, get up there, cube. Yeah, you fucking, I fucking hate these people, like, the, the, these enemies are annoying themselves, and, and the guy that, the assassin, it's, that's about to come out, once when I finish, like, tagging a certain amount of graffitis, it's even worse, that's why you gotta do, like, the big graffitis first, or else, like, you're, go, you're in for a bad time, so that's why, like, notice that I didn't even freaking do any of the small graffitis, cause, like, that, that shit itself, it's just, the first time I did it, I didn't think much of it until, like, I actually went up against these freaking assassins. Like, oh my god, I fucking hated them. I hate- oh shit. <laughs> I hated them a lot, dude. Like, it, was, it got to the point where, like, I wasn't freaking focusing. And, like, I literally just, like, fucking... Um... I literally fucking would get my ass beat by them when I first, like went up against them because I was like, alright, fuck it, I'm gonna just get these small tags instead of me thinking about, oh, yo, I'm gonna fucking get these big tags first, like, this asshole, what they have is a fucking whip. They have a whip and that shit actually really freaking hurts your character. And it fucking sucks. Are those things paused over there? I haven't seen that. I have not seen that. I, was like, I guess it's a, it's a glitch in the matrix. I'm gonna do these first. So all I got is just like single tapping graffitis to worry about. Taco Deli? <laughs> That's funny. Oh shit. When you hear that, literally, that just means, like, you're, 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 like, close to them. So, like, make sure that, um, you steer clear because, like, right now, he just tried to fucking whip me. Just, like, make sure you're always grinding onto something. Because, like, I'm telling you, these guys are just annoying to deal with. And I personally fucking hate them. Yes, sir. Alright, cool. I th oh, I think there's another graffiti that I gotta take care of by the fucking... Are you serious? Okay. Okay. No! No. I think I'm about to lose this because I'm running out of time. Fuck. Don't get whipped! Don't get whipped! Don't- Oh, God. You see what I mean? Okay. How many- Oh, yeah. I still got that one by the sign. Fuck. Okay. Alright, thank God. Okay, I was tripping because I was thinking about the one in the fucking- I was thinking about the other graffiti that I had to deal with in the free play. I got it. I got that one last graffiti that I got to deal with. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, how do you? Oh shit! Okay, I am really fucked. Oh my god, I have messed up. I messed that up so bad. Just to get these guys off of you, just like make sure. All right, I I think I got one more shot at this. I got one shot without getting freaking interrupted. Okay, okay, we made it barely. Holy shit! <laughs> I am shooting bricks over here.
I do not have mad skills. I fucking suck at this. But, dude, that fucking sucked right there. I did not like that whatsoever. There was a message on a piece of graffiti. I think it was from Coin. He told me to go to Grind Square. It seems like the punks that have been painting those ugly pieces of art have been hanging around Grind Square, too. They probably already know that we've been painting over their stuff with our own symbols. They may be dangerous, but we can't let them take over. It's time to throw a little spray paint party and see if they come and try to crash it. Yay. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I was fucking... Oh, God, dude. These these missions. The, these two missions about Grand City and Grand Square, basically, they're just like... The, these missions were like basically inspired after New York City. Literally. I like the fact that um, one of these ads is actually a freaking ad for um, instant chicken noodle soup, actually. Um, just instant chicken noodles, like cup of noodle, basically. But it's like not like not an actual one. Like, you know, like we got this car right here named the next breezer. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, I messed up. Alright, so. That's not the kid, bro. She basically a full grown woman. She is a full grown woman. She's not a teenager, but still. Don't. Oh no. Alright, so. Oh, fuck. All right. Fuck. All right. I'm not trying to do that. It's also the same thing right here. Make sure you get like the big ass graffitis because like you're in for a bad time if you don't. Because they got these annoying ass fucking uh they got these annoying ass um units that come in and basically just like if you're grinding they're they're gonna send like these electric shocks towards you and that shit like basically stops you dead and like dead in your tracks when you're grinding like it literally stops you and like fucking I don't know if you guys seen if you go in too slow your, your character is just automatically gonna hop off whatever you're grinding on and you're basically gonna fucking basically you're just gonna fucking fall and deal with that fall damage cause that th you know this game is kinda like like that is, does that say cuck? hold on that says cuck Oh my god, I did not realize that. <laughs> I literally sacrificed myself just to see what that said. <laughs> that said cuck. Okay. I love... <laughs> I have not seen that. The whole time I've ever played that, I was like, wait a minute. Am I actually seeing that? Alright, cool. This this is the unit that I'm talking about. They, they, they are human. Uh, surprisingly they are and uh fucking that's something you gotta deal with and I'll, I'll demonstrate what like you see those like elect that electricity basically how co oh yeah I don't have spray cans <gasps> no you fuck all right Or you gotta be quick with it because like I can barely even make shit happens. Oh shit. Okay. Just go up. Look, this is what I'm talking about, like these electric shocks right here. And then like he has to recharge. And basically just like try and dodge him because like it, it, it does get annoying and it does get to you it does get to you eventually so you gotta just watch out for these assholes if you end up playing this game 
All right, come on, come on. Land it! Oh, they're gonna send in choppers, by the way. They're pretty easy to take down. All right, go, 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 go. Land it, land it. Alright, so check this out. Um, so then you grind right here. Then you jump. Then after that, uh, just like uh, jump right here. You keep jumping just to like gain speed and all that. Just make sure that you just fucking just like stick your landings and shit like that. You know, just fucking. Cause this game is annoying as fuck and. Uh, so well, this game ain't annoying as fuck, but you 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 get oh shit. Well, you get what I mean. The, this game can be annoying as fuck sometimes. Meteor strikes, okay. Grand Square Theater. That's neat. And so Jetnet. <laughs> Digital computers. No, you just take down the you just take down the choppers like that basically. And uh, just to get the other one, just fucking Rokaku, man. Grand City landlords and shit like that. Fuck. Oh, they're gonna catch up to you. They're gonna catch. They, they. I'm, t I'm telling. You, fuck. Oh, you see what I mean? Basically, like. If it ain't one thing with these assholes, it's another fashion look and all. Okay, right, so fashion look, we got that. I'm just like reading the billboards and shit like that. So like, you know, you guys could read it too. Like we got uh, Rokaku Depot, we got Grind Street. I wonder, like if, the, look, you see Chinese noodle, like they actually have that shit. Apparently it's Chinese noodle. Ow, fuck. Russies. Restaurant Sparks House, just like imagine. And then there's like that cuck. There's that fucking. That yeah. There's that. There's that cuck. Orig uh. Uh. Orlen Oriental fast food cuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. I've I have not looked at some of the billboards before, like thoroughly. So like. <laughs> like fucking like bear with me because like my dumb ass yeah. Jesus Christ ah right, no oh I hate when they do this I, I already passed the level I already passed the level but still they always do that type of bullshit I got bad skills. um yeah I guess this one was went grind way smoother than uh grind uh grind city What's this golden rhino that he painted? Does it have anything to do with the Rokaku? Is all of this dad doing? By the way, that's uh, that's coin on the ground right there with those spray cans with that uh, with those spray can with the graffiti soul right there, where it just says coin with that spray can. Apparently, he died. Themselves, the GGs. 